Hey guys, this is KD and welcome to GetUtilized.com. Today I'm going to show you how to interface your ultrasonic sensor HCSRO4 with your Arduino Uno. So the things you'll be needing is obviously Arduino Uno, any sort of breadboard, your ultrasonic sensor, and some male-to-male -male connectors like this. So before we actually get started with the connections and the programming. Uh, let me tell you a few things about your ultrasonic sensor. It uh, basically has four pins over here and what this sensor does it it sends out ultrasonic pulses and receives at the same moment. So you know it uh, basically what a bat does it sends out ultrasonic pulses and if you have an obstacle in the middle they turn away. So we are going to do the same with the help of this sensor. Say if you are making a bot, we can use this as an eye so it can detect obstacles and you can turn your bot away. So basically four pins, the leftmost and the rightmost pin are for VCC and ground. Let me zoom in. Yeah, the leftmost pin is VCC and the rightmost pin is ground. So you are going to connect this to the ground uh, 5 volt and the ground over here on your Uno and the middle two pins are for trigger and echo now let me explain you a few things about these two pins now what this trigger pin does is it triggers this sensor to send out ultrasonic pulses and this echo pin receives the echoed ultrasonic waves so while connect this trigger pin to your Arduino Uno you have to declare any one of this digital pin as output and this echo pin needs to be declared as an input as simple as that so you'll be triggering ultrasonic pulses with the help of this trigger pin and receiving the reflected ultrasonic waves with the help of this echo pin as simple as that now let's get started with the connections okay first I'm, I'm gonna start with the supply to the 5 volt black one the ground okay now the trigger we have to use digital pins for the trigger and the echo so I think I'll be writing program for pin number 6 and 7 over here and the echo pin which will be as the input to your Arduino so we will be displaying all this on the serial monitor so here we go we have done with the connections as you can see maybe you want a closer look I'll zoom in See, pin number 6 and 7 are connected. Ultrasonic sensor. So basically what we are doing is we will be uh, receiving an output in the serial monitor with the help of some metric units like uh, centimeters and meters. So I like centimeters. So we will be displaying the output in the serial monitor with the help of centimeters so the programming is very simple so let's get this connected with the help of USB to our computer and let's get this thing programmed so here we go with the code uh, this code is for the ultrasonic sensor in centimeters and we have defined the two pins echo pin 7 and the trigger pin is on 6 coming to the setup we need a serial communication so we have written serial dot begin at 9600 pin mode trigger pin output so as I mentioned earlier, we will be sending ultrasonic pulses as an output. So we need to declare this trigger pin as output and same goes to the opposite that is echo pin input. Coming to the loop, uh, we have two integers declared distance and duration. Uh, digital right trick pin high, give it a delay and digital right trick pin low. So this trigger pin will be triggering the ultrasonic sensor to send ultrasonic waves every 100 milliseconds. The duration is equal to pulse in echo pin high. So we'll be receiving the duration and this duration will be of the ultrasonic waves sent, reflected and received. 
but we only need the duration of ultrasonic waves which are sent and reflected not the received so we need to divide it by 2 and this figure 29.1 gives you the exact value in centimeters so we'll just print it out serial dot distance pre print in centimeter and a new line you can also minimize this code over here and as you can see in the serial monitor we are getting centimeter values so let's check the sensor yeah okay now they are giving three centimeters as you can see my hand is almost three centimeters away from the ultrasonic sensor i'll be increasing the distance oh yeah seven centimeter 10 15 yeah so i think so we are getting a perfect value over here so the code is perfect you can also do the same for meters so we are good to go and any of you guys wanting to buy this sensor you can buy the sensor on www.vegarobocade.com same goes for the arduino uno